Whitney Houston, Natalie Cole. Natalie Cole, I've heard her name before. I've heard her name actually a pretty decent amount of times, but I don't think I've ever heard her music. I, If you ask me anything about Natalie Cole, I wouldn't have much for you. But Whitney Houston, yeah. Building up my Whitney Houston repertoire. I get sad when I watch Whitney because she was such a great talent, such a great voice, and and she's gone, and we will never, be, we'll never get that back. And I don't know. It's just I, I like Whitney Houston, but I get so sad when I watch her sing. Whenever I watch her perform. But anyway, no further ado. Whitney Houston, Natalie Cole, Bridge Over Troubled Water. Let's get into the video. That was great. But the real kicker was when we found ourselves sitting on the stage where we broke into a very unrehearsed version of another classic. And it was, well, see for yourself. I like her voice, and, I, and the way she hit, she did that was very smooth. That's why the cr the uh, crowd cheered. Very smooth. And the thing about this is, this is unrehearsed. This is our first time. Boom, turn it on and let's go. Mmm. I, 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 I think if, if if you just listen to it, it seems like it's like a concert. Like it is rehearsed, but it's unrehearsed and talent. And I wonder how. When when two singers sing, how they find that balance to ad lib here, and, and and to allow this person to get this, let them get that, and now like how do you find your role? I wonder when it's not rehearsed. Maybe they're friends and they had chemistry. I don't know. I don't know too much about know too much about their background, but I don't know. That that's a good question. I wonder how they come up with that. With, with with the role within the song, is it something that I don't know? I don't know. We 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 have to dig more into that. <laughs> The strength, the power behind the voice is so crazy. Just listen to it. Listen to how she just commands the stage, the stage presence, the lights, the, the, the hitting the nose and the lights, the way it came together, the way it worked together. Just watch this part. Wow. Wow. Listen to the voice, the strength, the power. It, Whitney had it all.
one thing about growing up in church, you hear, you know church going people when you hear it. And that is exactly what it is. It's two women that grew up in church singing together. I don't know much about Natalie Cole's. I know that Whitney Houston grew up in church. Don't know a lot about Natalie Cole, but I'm willing to bet that she grew up in church. Just by the way, you get the influence that the church has on the music. The influence is just splattered all. You can just feel the influence on from the church in the way that they sing. Just especially this section right here. What you gonna do? What you gonna do about it? between these two is incredible and i don't know maybe it's because they have if they were friends before if they have the church background that they're able to sing this so well with it being unrehearsed with it being them just picking up the mic and going and see how it goes because you can just tell this as, as a concert piece and i would believe you i would think that this is boom it doesn't seem unrehearsed, like I'm saying. So the chemistry aspect in this video is really high and you can really tell. But I wonder where it stems from. I wonder where it stems from. <laughs> something unrehearsed and just boom pick up the mics and go that's how you do a song like that now like i said earlier the chemistry was obviously there but were they friends before this is it because they both went to church that they've been able to find their role within the song so well but you can hear the church influence all over the way that they sing all over it all over it um Natalie Cole. Natalie Cole has a voice. A nice, a, a, I like her voice a lot. And, and she has range. It seems like she can do a myriad of things. So I wonder why in previous great singer conversations, I don't see Natalie Cole's name come up. Maybe I'm not hanging with the right generation. Is she kind of unsung? Is she kind of forgotten? I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think. But that's going to be it for the video, y'all. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll be back to you guys next time. I'm out.